Hello loves. It's Jovia Fell again. And welcome back to my channel. For today's video, we are going to talk about Best Laptops in 2021 The 15 Best Laptops You Can Buy Top of 2021 can come with a variety of brands, prices, and features. Here, we've got the rest of the best laptops, Windows 10 Business Notebooks, Gaming Rigs, Chromebooks, laptops for school, and two-in-one convertibles. When it comes time to work, whether that's editing photos, writing a lot of emails, composing documents, or staying in touch with colleagues and family, we're here with our top picks to help you find the best laptop for the job. 15. Lenovo Yoga 9i. The best multimedia laptop. Most thin and light laptops share one significant weakness, thin, tinny audio. That's not the case with the Lenovo Yoga 9i. This 14-inch convertible has a rotating soundbar in its hinge, meaning that no matter how it's positioned, the speakers face outwards. There's a lot more to like as well. You get an excellent 1080p touch display and a built-in stylus for easy artwork and note-taking. The 11th gen processors deliver satisfactory performance and all-day battery life. The audio quality, screen, and convertible form factor all add up to an unbeatable machine for multimedia entertainment. Number 14. Razer Book 13. A stylish, powerful productivity laptop. Razer is best known for its gaming laptops, but the company is making a big splash in the business and productivity space with its new Razer Book 13. At 0.6 inches thick and 3.09 pounds, the Book 13 portable workstation with a gorgeous and sturdy aluminum build. It features a good port selection including Thunderbolt 4, USB-A, HDMI 2.0 and a micro SD slot, and it's one of very few non-gaming laptop. Number 13. Lenovo Chromebook Duet. The best laptop for students. Lenovo's Chromebook Duet is a great convertible laptop for kids or anyone who wants a reliable secondary driver for browsing and games. It's a nice-looking, well-made 10-inch device that comes with a detachable keyboard and kickstand. Number 12. HP Elite Dragonfly. The best business laptop. If you're a business professional and money is no object for you or your company, you can't do better than the HP Elite Dragonfly. The 2020 model is the first Dragonfly that features HP's Super Secure Sure View Reflect technology, which tints the screen so that snoops can't see what you're doing while you're working in public. When it's not tinted, the display gets quite bright, over 700 nits. Number 11. MacBook Pro, 16 INCH, 2019. A great choice for Mac power users. The 16-inch MacBook Pro is the best Apple laptop for power users. Apple dealt with the biggest complaints that people have historically had about MacBook Pros, and if you can stomach the price, there's not a lot else to complain about. Number 10. Asus ROG Zephyrus G14. The best 14 INCH gaming laptop. The Zephyrus G14 is an astonishingly powerful gaming laptop for a low price, relative to other notebooks with comparable hardware. It pairs AMD's new Ryzen 9 4900HS with an NVIDIA RTX 2060 Max-Q GPU and a 120Hz display, and it can run demanding games at their highest settings without a problem. It's also quite light for such a powerful laptop, weighing just over 3.5 pounds. Number 9. Lenovo ThinkPad X1 Nano. The best laptop for business travel. In many ways, the ThinkPad X1 Nano is a run-of-the-mill ThinkPad. It's got a solid sturdy chassis, discreet clickers, a physical privacy shutter, a red track point in the middle of the keyboard, and all kinds of business-specific security and management features. But Nano is special because lightest ThinkPad Lenovo has ever made. It also one of lightest laptops you can buy, at just 1.99 pounds. You not sacrificing performance to get that mind-blowing weight, the Nano kept up with our heavy testing workloads without any fan noise or noticeable heat. If you're looking reliable business laptop that will feel like nothing in your briefcase, this one is for you. At just over 4 pounds, the Zephyrus G15 is one of the lightest 15-inch gaming laptops you can buy. But you're not compromising performance for the portability. The G15 is powered by the top mobile chips AMD and Nvidia have to offer, and pairs them with a fast 165Hz QHD display. In our testing, the system was able to handle even the toughest AAA titles at QHD resolution. Almost everything else about the G15 is great too, the audio sounds good, 
The keyboard and touchpad are some of the best on the market, the port selection has just about everything you'd need, and the battery can last over 8.5 hours to a charge. If you're looking for a high-powered gaming machine that also works great as a daily driver, the Zephyrus G15 should be at the top of your list. Number 7. Dell XPS 13, Late 2020. The best laptop for college. The Dell XPS 13 is a compact and reliable laptop. Its beautiful chassis, excellent 1610 display, and great performance make it an excellent choice for general purpose users. This late 2020 model comes with Intel's new Tiger Lake processors, from a Core i3 1154G4 up to a Core i7 1165G7. It starts at $999, so it's a bit cheaper than the 2 in 1. My review unit, an i7 model, blew through the work tasks I needed it to do without any slowdown or heat. It did quite well, and handily beat its 10th gen predecessor in both gaming and media work. It didn't do as well as the XPS 13 2 in 1, which is why that model is ranked higher on this list. Number 6. Dell XPS 13 2 in 1. A great 2 in 1 laptop. If you're looking for a convertible laptop that does just about everything right, we recommend Dell's latest XPS 13 2 in 1. It features a sturdy and well made chassis, a nearly bezel free 1610 touch display, and Intel's newest 11th gen processors. The base model, for $1,099, includes a Core i3 1154G4, 8GB of RAM, a 1920x1200 display, and a 256GB SSD. You can spec that up to a 3840x2400 display, a Core i7 1165G7, 32GB of RAM, and a 1TB SSD. There are various add-ons as well, you can pay $50 extra for a white model and $60 to upgrade to Windows 10 Pro. Basically, there's something for everyone. Number 5. MacBook Pro 13, Late 2020. The best MacBook Pro for everyday users. If you're looking to buy an M1 MacBook for heavier workloads, you'll want to look at the Late 2020 MacBook Pro. It starts at $1,299, which is $300 more than the Late 2020 MacBook Air. The MacBook Pro has a slightly different design and look than the Air, as well as a few additional features like the touch bar. But the two have the same processor. The main difference is that the Pro includes a fan, the Air is fanless, which means it can sustain heavy workloads for a longer period of time without needing to throttle its performance. Number 4. HP NVX 360, 2020. The best budget laptop in 2021. You don't need to spend $1,000 to get a laptop that looks and feels premium. The HP NVX 360 2020 is the best budget laptop you can buy, thanks to its sturdy and compact build, chic convertible design, and excellent performance. Part of what makes the NV so great is that HP has ported over a number of elements from its excellent 2019 flagship, the Spectre X360, including the thin and light chassis and nearly bezel-free display with an 88% screen-to-body ratio. The touchscreen, which supports HP's MPP 2.0 pen, is bright and looks great. You can choose a 300 nit, 400 nit, or 1000 nit panel. But the most exciting feature is inside, the new NVX 360 is powered by AMD's Ryzen 4000 series. The Ryzen 5 4500U in my model did an outstanding job with a fairly heavy load of multitasking. And AMD's integrated Radeon graphics delivered good gaming performance comparable to what you'd expect from a lower-powered discrete GPU. Number 3. LG Gram 17, 2021. The best laptop in 2021 for big-screen fans. Even if you've used a light laptop before, it's difficult to explain how light the LG Gram 17 is. It has a massive 17-inch display, but it's somehow only 3 pounds. Picking it up messes with your mind, you feel like you're not holding anything. But the Gram 17's weight isn't the only standout feature. It also has some of the best battery life you can get, lasting over 12 hours in our testing. Add a great keyboard, a solid port selection, quiet fans, and a fast processor, and there's very little not to like about this device. Not everyone needs a 17-inch display, and many folks who do are looking for a heavier-duty workstation that probably doesn't get moved very often. But if you just really like a large screen for your daily office work and Netflixing, you're the target demographic for this machine. It's an itch, but truly impressive device without much real competition in today's market. Number 2. HP Spectre X360 14. The best window laptop. 
It's hard to come up with a single complaint about the Spectre X360 14. It's a drop-dead gorgeous machine with a sturdy build and a premium look and feel. But the Spectre X360 14 isn't just pretty to look at, it's also a pleasure to use as a daily work driver. Intel's latest 11th gen processors and Iris Z integrated graphics deliver snappy performance with no slowdown or freezes that we observed. And we got an average of 10 hours of battery life out of the device, one of the best results we've ever seen. And finally, top number 1. MacBook Air, late 2020. The best laptop of 2021. The late 2020 MacBook Air, powered by Apple's M1 processor, is the best laptop you can buy. The base model, which includes 8GB of RAM and 256GB of storage, starts at $999. Appearance-wise, this laptop has a lot in common with the Intel-powered MacBook Air that Apple released earlier this year, including the same 2560 by 1600 screen, Touch ID, 720p webcam, fingerprint sensor, and scissor switch keyboard. But the new processor is the star of the show here, it's fast. In our testing, it handled intense photo and video editing workloads better than almost any Intel-powered laptop we've tried this year. It was also able to run Shadow of the Tomb Raider at close to playable frame rates, which is quite a feat for integrated graphics. And there you have it. The top 15 best laptops that you can buy in 2021. What do you think? Do you agree on our list? Do you have an idea on what list are we going to do next? Let us know in the comments section below. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell, so you will be notified when we have new video coming out. Thanks for watching. Until then.